Okay, let's look at the implications, some sentences we can talk about here. After a strong conclusion, you are now ready to bring up the implications of the conclusion. What does it mean? Implications reinforce the conclusion by telling the audience what will happen in the future. This part of the presentation is usually short and gives the speaker a chance to speculate or kind of think about the future, what's possible. Let's look at some sentences we can use. If these recommended actions are taken, we expect a 10% increase in market share. These findings can be used to design a much better package that consumers will like. With further research, we will be able to Now, with this information, we can take action by You can see that here in the implication, we're really emphasizing this future tense. Something can happen in the future. Things may get better or worse in the future. We may have an opportunity in the future. There may be more research needed in the future. That's really what we're focusing on here. The future can be different if we make some changes. By continuing this kind of research, we will be able to find answers that may lead to a cure for some illnesses. With this clear conclusion, it is clear that this company cannot go on without making some changes. Continuing with this approach, we expect profits to show increases over the next five years. With this plan, we will have a win-win situation where both management and stakeholders outside the firm are satisfied. It is clear from this conclusion that my proposed action has the potential to increase profits. And again, I'm just emphasizing here that we just had our conclusion. So the conclusion, we just had it like a minute ago. And so it's clear from that conclusion or the conclusion shows us clearly. This is a good way to emphasize the implications are linked linked directly to the conclusion. Your conclusion has specific implications for the future. So you need to make that link clear. With this information, we now can say without doubt that our human resource problems can only be solved if we in the next three months we propose to find more support with the conclusions I just covered. These conclusions force us to face important issues raised by the new competition. Okay, let's look at some more practice sentences there. We just had many phrases that we can use and sentences. Now let's look at some modular sentences to help with this. I would like to conclude by, I would like to conclude by summing up, it's a good signal. I would like to conclude by quickly reviewing. I would like to conclude by restating. Therefore, in conclusion, in sum, in sum, I can say with confidence, 
these are all really good signals. We're sending a signal that the conclusion is coming. We're going to wrap up the presentation soon. Okay, the main points, the main points I have covered, the main points covered in this presentation, the main points we studied, so here we have a nice summary, right? I first I signal the ending, now I give you a summary of the points from the presentation. Finally, there is no doubt left. Finally, the implications are clear. Finally, we can see that, so we, here we have our conclusion. We come to our conclusion and we may have some implications. Now that you understand, I think you will agree that. Now that you understand, we can see the implications. Now that you understand, the future direction is clearly an interesting point. An interesting point that summarizes the whole issue. An interesting point that reinforces our findings is an interesting point in contrast to our findings is I think here this is a good example of again I just come right out and say it this is my interesting point we want to emphasize our main points so this is an interesting point and then this interesting point is the whole issue or this is part of our findings or there may be something else, something even more uh, related to, but not exactly the same as our main point. We've run out of time. It's a good signal, isn't it? We've run out of time, so I will summarize by saying, we've run out of time, but I think you get the point. We've run out of time, although there is so much more, meaning so much more that I can cover, but I don't have time, so I need to move on to the conclusion. So this is a really good signal that the conclusion is coming. I'm out of time. I think you can now see, I think you can now see that our work points to I think you can now see that this research supports. I think you can now see our direction has implications. And I like this because it's saying, I just told you all these things. Now you know them. Now you understand them. So I want to move on to tell you what the implications are.